What's up guys? I'm back and welcome back to Ready Test Go. By the way, my name is Nicole and today we are going to have another personality test and we're going to base it on your choice of perfume. So, ready, test, go! Are you a fan of perfumes? Well, did you know that your choice of perfume can say a lot about your personality? Well, this time we are going to find out what does your perfume says about your personality. So here we have some list of different types of perfume. I want you to choose one that you like the most or the one that you usually use. So I'm going to give you 10 seconds to choose. I think this is not a hard question since this is the type of perfume that you like most, right? Well, anyways, let's find out the results. Citrus lovers lead the pack. Do you always take charge in a group situations? Would your friends and family describe you as an alpha man or woman? Then you guys are a strong-minded, ambitious, natural leaders. You guys might be viewed as dominant or aggressive. But don't worry, there's no shame of being a shark at work and in your love life. Just make sure you don't come across as too sour when things don't go the way you wanted. Rose wearers are cautious. These people are introspective and sensitive to the needs of others. They tend to weigh all options before making a choice. Impulse control has never been an issue for you as you are naturally cautious and considerate. You take the time to reflect on your decisions instead of simply diving right into the action. Your rosy record is all clean in all the paths of life because you think before you act. Lavender fans make great friends. If you love wearing lavender scented perfumes, then maybe you have a huge close knit network of friends. People consider you easy to be around right off the bat, which is why you get along so well with just about everyone. People who prefer lavender tend to be sexually reserved but curious individuals. You guys value friendship and you tend to work well in groups. You guys are thoughtful when it comes to your closest pals. You are the one person who never fails to surprise them on their birthdays. And you can be counted on to always go out of your way to cheer someone off during their tough times. Vanilla types are not vanilla at all. You are probably thinking that people who like vanilla are bland and have a vanilla personality. But it's just the opposite. People who like vanilla are lively, energetic, live of a party. They are anything but vanilla. It's the opposite of what you would have thought because they are fun, loving people. If you smell of warm vanilla, you are the person who knows how to get a party started. You love dancing, drinking, meeting new people, and socializing in buzzing atmosphere. Staying at home on the weekend is not your cup of tea as you'd rather spend the night on the town. Sandalwood wearers are high achieving. If you gravitate towards sandalwood, then we know that you are a total perfectionist. You've been your biggest critic your entire life. But while being hard on yourself is totally draining, this trait has gotten you where you are right now. Sandalwood lovers tend to have high expectations for themselves and for others. They are very self-critical, easily offended by physical remarks, and can misinterpret what others say about them. 
fruity fragrance fans are moody. I actually imagined that people who wear fruity perfumes would be as sweet as the strawberry scent on their neck, but apparently I was mistaken. They tend to be more irritable, cranky, and pessimistic. If you love anything that smells of berries, apples, or tropical fruits, then it's time to adjust your attitude. You tend to view the glass half empty, plus you are are sarcastic and easily annoyed. And while this cynical sense of humor might seem hilarious to you, it's actually exhausting to those around you. If you don't try to cheer up and kick the moodiness, you'll soon find yourself isolated. Sartorialist can't get enough of coconut. Coconut lovers are the most stylish and fashion forward among the others. They are immaculate dressers that can be thought of as wearing expensive jewelry. They are authoritative leaders who take charge in situations. They are also sensitive to criticism. Coconut wearers enjoy the finer things in life, which means they've got closet full of designer labels and appetite for precious gems. You command attention in a room and enjoy making decisions on behalf of others. People around you trust your intuitions and taste, so you regularly have admirers watching your every move. Linen lovers are drawn to challenges. If you smell of linen, you are someone who runs or go to the gym for fun. People are amazed that you are always training for something extraordinary. But you can't get enough of these physical and mental tests. You enjoy pushing through endurance to the limits. And you have an anything is achievable with hard work attitude linen fans are action oriented you enjoy physical and mental challenges you are extremely competitive in debates and games and you routinely set tough personal goals for yourself Gardenia wearers are stable. Gardenia wearers are steady and dependable. They enjoy safe, secure relationships. They are followers more than leaders. They are team players and people pleasers. You'd much rather be in a comfortable, long-term relationship than endure the unpredictability and disappointment of serial dating. You are someone that doesn't just pop into someone's life fleetingly. You maintain friendship for decades and never lose touch no matter the physical distance in your relationships. Jasmine fans are wild. Jasmine aficionados are perhaps similar to vanilla wearing people, but they take their fun a step Further. They crave novelty and enjoy new and exciting adventures. They are provocative and can be thought of as partiers who enjoy a good time. They absolutely love dancing and they couldn't care less about what other people might think about them or how they dress. They are true to their belief that life is worth living. So they don't waste a single time being bored stiff and it is safe to say that spontaneous is their middle name. Honeysuckle means happy. You know, they are those who are just pure delight to have around. Honeysuckle fans are happy-go-lucky, laid back, and never going to cause drama. They are the cheerful person in your friend group who simply wants to be happy and avoid darkness. They'll lift you up and leave you feeling positive every time you hang out. Honeysuckles are empathic, easygoing, and well-adjusted. So, how was the result? Was it accurate with your personality? Well, I hope it did. And if you like this video, I hope that you can give me a thumbs up and subscribe on my channel. 
You can also tell me what you think about this in the comment section below. Have a great day everyone, stay safe, and see you on my next video. Bye!